Welcome to the Bow. We're in Core Lines, Bow Advisors' brand new seafood restaurant. We feel that we have developed a beautiful restaurant, pays homage to the Gulf Coast, pays homage to the Gulf of Mexico, New Orleans inspired seafood restaurant. We have fresh fish, fresh crab, and we have fried uh, oysters. We have char grilled oysters, raw oysters. We have a little bit of everything that paid Thomas to the Gulf Coast. Um, our dining room is very beautiful. You look, when you come in, you see the Gulf of Mexico, you see the pelicans and the birds flying by. It's a very scenic atmosphere. It's a very beautiful restaurant. We're very proud of it. We hope you see, come and see us soon. We're open Thursday through Monday. We open at 4.30 through 10. Thursday, Sunday, and Monday. We open 4.30 to 10.30, Friday and Saturday. Very popular new restaurant. Reservations are highly recommended. You can go to Beauravage.com or call us to book. See you soon. Welcome to Coralines in the Kitchen. Well, today we will pre be preparing the Snapper Coraline dish. So in front of us here, we have all of our meats and plies. So obviously a beautiful piece of red snapper. The head-on Gulf shrimp shiitake mushrooms, asparagus, shallots, potatoes, butter, obviously a little salt and pepper, and we're gonna finish with some chives and some chive wool. To start this dish, we need the bread, the snapper. So we're gonna go to seasoned flour. This is a traditional egg wash. Make sure you get it coated very nice and even. And our potato flake. Make sure you got a nice even crust. Come to our skillet here. Make sure we got our oil nice and hot, but not too hot. Lay it down, always lay away. In the second skillet, we have our potatoes started. Just trying to get a little bit of color on those guys. Then we're gonna go in with the shiitake mushrooms. Now while doing this, we need to make sure we're keeping a watchful eye on our snapper here. Just want to do a little saute here. About 10, 15 seconds just to incorporate that. Come back on with some heat. All right. Go in with a little bit of shallots. All right. And at this point, we want to season. Come back to our fish here. We see the edges starting to get nice and golden. We can take a peek. I think she's ready to flip here. All right. Nice crust on that. So we're just gonna get a little bit of sear on the bottom of that fish, and then we're gonna go into the oven, about six minutes. Come back to our veg here. We're gonna hit it with some asparagus tips. Asparagus is already blanched. Just wanna do a quick saute on that. At this point, we can go into the oven. Turn our veg down on low. Keep an eye on our vegetables. All right. I wish you could smell it. It smells good. So at this point, we're just going to take a little tap of butter. Go in there with that. This is our Coraline sauce. This is the sauce that's with the dish. So it's nice and hot, ready to go. Okay. Our oil's hot enough. Want to go down with that beautiful shrimp. Now we don't want to overcook this shrimp. You overcook that shrimp, it's not good. So at this point, our Vegetables are nice and caramelized. We're good there. We want to control the heat. At this point, our fish is about three minutes out. So Coraline sauce is a uh, shiitake mushroom white wine reduction. It has some spices, garlic, onions, a little bit of uh, Cajun spices, some acid in there. Very light, very delicate. Goes really good with the crisp on that fish, okay? 
So we're gonna turn our shrimp at this point, come back in, another tap of butter. That's about a minute out, we're ready to go. So we can control that heat. The bottom of this dish is gonna be the sauce. So nice, can't go wrong with a good portion of sauce. And a little bit more, right? We lay that down here. Now we come back to our vegetables. All right. No particular order here. Just want to kind of have a bed. Bed for that fish to sit on. Check our shrimp. We're almost there. Cooking all my life, really. I was actually picky as a child, believe it or not, and uh, I started cooking. So my mom didn't want to make two meals, so I started going in the kitchen to figure out how to make things happen professionally 12 years. 12 years now. So I've been at the Boerweiss currently seven years. Uh, former chef of BR Prime, I came here, wanted to open a new venue. Uh, it's going really, really well. We're very busy, um, you know, and we're just we're getting the feedback and making changes and continue to elevate uh, based on feedback and our loyal guests. Okay, we're going to pull our fish. Beautiful crust, huh? That's what makes this dish. Slide it down, nice like so. Okay, we're done with that. We can move that out the way. And we come back for our beautiful shrimp. Put it there. Gonna garnish with a little bit of chives, give it some color and a little bit of flavor. And also go back with just a little bit of chive oil. There we have it, folks. Snapper core line. Our beautiful steamed Alaskan king crab. These are our fan favorite, and they're sweet. They are really, really good. We're very proud of this product. Window cut, so it's easily accessible for you to eat. Dip it in some butter and enjoy. Beautiful Royal Reds caught in about 2,000 feet of water out here in the Gulf. They're very sweet, very beautiful, beautiful product. So here we have our version of a poke, tuna, yellowfin tuna, Gulf tuna. Very beautiful, very light, one of my favorites. So here I think we've put everything we have in the kitchen in this dish. Um, Coraline salads, we have hearts of palm, cherry tomatoes, roasted corn, croutons, red bell pepper, cucumber, olives, pickled red onion, sunflower seeds, a citrus vinaigrette, and of course, beautiful U8 golf shrimp. Thank you for joining us in the kitchen today. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. We look forward to seeing you. As for me, thank you.